Hey, it's Joy. Greetings from Singapore. Yes, I am here for the first ever TeslaCon Singapore. I've been invited by Darren, the organizer, to speak on a panel about FSD. So let me take you to the conference. This was the first ever Southeast Asia Tesla car owners and supporters gathering. This was 100% volunteer based and they sold about 500 tickets. Tesla Owners Club Thailand even caravan down to Singapore from Thailand through Malaysia to attend this event. Linda Tan, who was on my panel, she drove up from Singapore through Malaysia and met up with the Thailand members and caravan with them back down to Singapore. I also met up with Heather and Cameron, aka Mei Xi Tai Tai on YouTube. They have a huge Chinese speaking YouTube channel about Tesla's EV, travel, and lifestyles. Uh, I'm Heather Yin from San Francisco, and I have a, a Mandarin speaking Mandarin, uh, Tesla channel. It's called Mei Xi Tai Tai. Maybe some of you know, some of you don't know, but it's okay. So basically, I'm a, a Model Y and Model S owner in California, but it's kind of through the channel. So we, uh, I, we started, we connected to with my hometown, Taiwan, the people, the people over there. So we, I also have some experience in Taiwan. And to, today, I'm going to share some amazing uh, Tesla experience in Taiwan too. I attended the Tesla insurance and FSD safety panel and shared my perspective on Tesla safety, FSD usage, and Tesla insurance. I do have a personal story. The day I picked up my Model 3 in 2018, I drove it to show my mother my brand new car and on the freeway in Los Angeles, round trip twice, it helped me to avoid two potential accidents when there are cars in my adjacent lanes drifted or veered into my lane and they were in my blind spot. I didn't know until the car started beeping at me, asking me to take control. And the car actually moved a little bit away from the intruding vehicle. So since day one, I started building my confidence in the capability and the safety of this car. As an FSD beta tester for the last two years, I have, I hold an unpopular opinion about this. Um, I think it's not going to be fully autonomous or level five, unless other cars on this road are also driving autonomously. Because right now, as you guys know in the insurance, right, accidents happen because human make mistakes. So as long as there are human drivers on the road, people will doze off, they may not, they may be distracted, they will make mistakes, and your car is, you know, it, it, I mean, my car is on FSD, but there have been people that was just like cut in front of me or veer in front of me and thankfully my car stopped and I my car had never rear-ended anybody but they're just scary moments like that so my opinion is unless other cars are also autonomous on the road it's level five is really hard to achieve well, I just have my panel on uh, Tesla safety clarifying any mis understanding or misconception about this car um, because you know we know there are a lot of fuds out there still so um, I'm just really honored to be a part of this event and uh, thank you so much Darren for inviting me to speak and participate and I'm just really happy to also have met many um, Tesla community members here in Singapore whom I have interacted with on um, x.com and it was just great walking up and say hey I recognize your name and to chat with them and put the face with their handle and um, I have said this many times before if you are not a part of your local Tesla club even if you do not own a Tesla 
I encourage you, highly encourage you to check out a um, Tesla Owners Club meetup locally to meet other owners. And if you're a potential owner, you're just kind of shopping and you have questions about Tesla, people will be able to answer those questions for you and uh, help you to make a decision whether you want to go with Tesla or if you want to go with a different brand of EVs. But um, eventually the ultimate goal is um, we are uh, promoting the the mission of Tesla is to help to uh, accelerate world's transition to sustainable energy. And um, this community is just amazing. And also earlier, um, there was a panel where Tesla Owners Club Thailand, they actually drove down from Thailand to attend this event. So if this, this is the very first Tesla gathering, big gathering here in Southeast Asia. And um, I am so happy that this took place and I look forward to having this event every single year. And uh, bravo to Darren and the whole Tesla Con Singapore team for all their hard work in putting this event together. I am so honored to be a part of the first, the very first TeslaCon Singapore or the first Tesla owners and enthusiasts gathering in Southeast Asia. They had people coming down from Thailand, people coming down from Malaysia. It was just amazing to see the community together and everyone just so passionate about Tesla and its mission. And kudos to Darren and all the staff and volunteers at TeslaCon Singapore. Thank you for putting on this incredible event. It takes so much to do this. And you guys had like 500 people registered and showing up. So congratulations on a job really, really well, incredibly done. And here's to many more to come. Thank you so much for coming with me to TeslaCon Singapore. I will see you in the next video and God bless.